I am not the same Anusha Oshuri who lived before being arrested. And I can never go back to that previous life. When I was transferred to the prison compound itself, into the notorious Hall 12, which was a dungeon, uh, I started getting friends with the, with the inmates and a few of them used to do uh, exercises every morning. And I asked if I could join them and they welcomed me. I started running with them, uh, but I went short of breath within 10 minutes. So I started persevering and trying to uh, run for a longer period uh, until I reached a point where I managed to run for two hours and 47 seconds exactly because I had a stopwatch. Uh, when I returned to our hall, uh, this uh, friend who was a satirist, he, he called me from the other end of this uh, patio that we had with a book in his hand. And he said, this is for you. And it was the book by uh, Haruki Murakami, uh, what I talk about when I talk about running. It really inspired me to participate in uh, London Marathon any time that I was released. And I paper, I should, uh, I should have been released uh, uh, five years from now. Luckily, I was released uh, in March, and now this is dream come true, so. I did dream of uh, one day running uh, in the parks in London. And now that I'm running here, it's amazing that now I get flashbacks and all these faces come in front of my eyes as I'm running, for example, in Greenwich Park. All those friends, as if I'm, I'm running with them in Greenwich Park. But unfortunately, they are still stuck there. I sometimes uh, get a flashback that I may be there right now in that rectangular yard with all the things that I remember uh, in there. It is a challenge. And what I've noticed is that in addition to these flashbacks, which are some of them are really disturbing, uh, I've got, started getting anxiety attacks as well, which I didn't have two months ago. I think I was overwhelmed with the joy of being released. So that wasn't very pronounced. But now that I'm getting, we're just passing six months uh, since my release. So I'm getting these anxiety. Well, I have to deal with them. This is another challenge uh, that I have to overcome. Perseverance is the best answer to many of these problems uh, like this. Uh, somebody actually gave, uh, told me about these two golden rules uh, in prison. The two golden rules are rule number one for victory is that you should always remember that perseverance pays off. Golden rule number two is never to forget <laughs> rule number one. <laughs> Even if I'm crawling, I should cross that finish line. I'm really feeling excited and nervous at the same time. So, let's see how it goes.